While climbing a flight of stairs might be part of the duties of firefighters, they will soon be climbing 69 flights of stairs for a special fundraiser. With a vertical elevation of 788 feet, the Columbia Center in Seattle is the second tallest building west of the Mississippi. 2,000 firefighters from around the world, including members of the Great Falls Fire Rescue, will soon ascend the tower for the 14th year to raise funds through the Leukemia and Lymphoma Society. Whenever you talk about raising funds in competition, the firefighters kind of, you know, kind of like that uh, idea. So we've been involved, and. Um, been a great opportunity to go out to Seattle and raise funds for a great cause. The event also hopes to bring awareness to all different forms of cancer as well. All cancer is what we're fighting for within the fire service and so for me to go out there and, and do the stair climb, raise the funds, it's to support an, organiza an organization like the um, Leukemia Lymphoma Society so that they can um, go against the fight against cancer. Each year, they share stories of blood cancer survivors as well as those who were tragically lost. It's meaningful and important to us because um, we're in the fire service and a lot of what we do is EMS and so we see a lot of people that um, struggle with cancer or any other type of issues and also a lot of families um, within our department are affected by cancer and I think that's just one of the main reasons why it's important to us to raise money for that and go up there and do it for a cause. With the stair climb nearly one month away, those participating will be climbing over a thousand steps with full turnout gear. I'm just excited that uh, I get to challenge myself by doing this. Um, and I know, I know I'm going to be really tired at the top. Uh, I might not have the best time, but uh, it's going to be a good time. The stair climb will take place on March 13th, but fundraisers will be next Saturday, February 12th, and Monday, February 14th. To learn more, you can check out our website. Reporting in Great Falls, Cade Venter, MTN News.